The feds are going after former Nebraska Congressman Jeff Fortenberry again. A federal appeals court reversed his conviction for lying to the FBI. Now he's been indicted for a second time. KETV News Watch 7's Julie Cornell is on the live desk. Thanks, Cornicia. Bill, before we get to the new indictment, let's start with the reversal. This was back in December. An appeals court said prosecutors should not have tried Fortenberry in Los Angeles since the case revolved around evidence in Nebraska and Washington. Well, that's why today's grand jury indictment comes from Washington. It's the same case as before. The FBI says Fortenberry lied to them about a foreign campaign contribution back in 2016. Foreign donations are illegal, but the feds believe a Nigerian-born billionaire gave $30,000 to Fortenberry's re-election campaign. Investigators say the person who hosted the fundraiser told Fortenberry the money was illegal, but he did not file an amended report with the Federal Election Commission. The FBI says Fortenberry lied to them twice by telling them he didn't know about any foreign contributions. We were in California for the trial and his conviction in 2022. The judge ordered him to pay a fine and gave him community service. But Fortenberry faces two counts, making false statements, along with falsifying and concealing material facts. His spokesman just responded to the indictment. Chad Colton says this case has defined overzealous prosecution from the earliest days of the investigation. He says retrying it in D.C. highlights, quote, prosecutors vindictive obsession with destroying a good man's life. Back to you. All right, Julie, thank you.